the EU has expanded its sanctions, uh, imposing sanctions on two Crimean companies along with some other individuals. What do you make of this? Not much. It's not going to have much effect at all. Uh, it seems to be grandstanding more than anything else. I mean, it's almost impossible to impose sanctions on Russia. I mean, get out a map. How are you going to do it? And there are lots of people who would love to trade with Russia and will. And unfortunately, we, the U.S., are shooting ourselves in the foot because we're just forcing them into Asia, and the Asians will welcome them with open arms. And you've said in the past that Russia is one of the, um, the cheapest and most hated markets in the world. Yep. Is it time to buy then? Well, I don't know. I bought some uh, last time, I think last time we spoke, I told you I hadn't bought much because I was too lazy, but I've geared up my efforts now. Uh, I did buy a little bit when, I, when they went into, when Crimea took place. And I am, if I weren't talking to you right now, I'd probably be buying some more Russia. I'm looking for some more Russia to buy. It is hated and it is cheap and they do have massive assets. Okay, and specifically, what are you looking at? What are you buying right now? Well, I don't know. That's the point. I'm trying to find, I own, you know, Moscow is the home of Lenin and Stalin. I own shares of the Moscow Stock Exchange. I bought a little Aeroflot. I bought Indexes. I'm looking for things to buy.